Five students and two teachers of the Presentation College Chagornis Robotics team, including Principal Dr. Rennie Wibby, returned to Trinidad and Tobago on Friday after spending just over one week in Athens, Greece, where they competed in the first Global Robotics Challenge. Jason John has more in this report. Students of the Presentation College Chaguanas Robotics team returned on October 4th after placing third in the first Global Robotics Challenge held in Athens, Greece from September 26th to the 29th and featured 193 competing teams. According to Principal of Presentation College Chaguanas, Dr. Rene Wibby, the feeling was surreal. He describes the team as just a team that left Trinidad and Tobago simply seeking acknowledgement. It was such a, a, a wonderful feeling that to see these boys, you know, they worked so hard and they were able to at least be, celebrate their success. And it means a lot for us, especially Trinidad and Tobago. And I hope that in the future we will get more assistance in terms of sponsorship because we worked very hard to get sponsors to take them because it's not Presentation College Chaguanas, it is Trinidad and Tobago. Head Prefect Dimitri Sinarine says the entire school supported the team, had high expectations and were confident they would do well. I was ecstatic because I mean, telling the whole world, I mean, that, that's something to be excited about. And, you know, the boys at school really were proud and happy that this, they were able to get this this far. Presentation College Robotics team captain Xavier Blasch says the feeling is indescribable. He notes when they began, they had high expectations based on the history of Presentation's robotics achievements thus far, and can only hope this encourages further interest by other students. I really hope that it will encourage them to even surpass me, to do much better, to bring home the gold medal next year. That you see, the, uh, We have a lot of youths with talent in robotics, not only just in Prez, but all over the country. According to COVID Capaldeo, the student in charge of social media for the team and the human player for the robotics challenge, it was nerve-wracking at the start as the pressure was immense representing not only Presentation College but Trinidad and Tobago. You know, I just had to make sure that I trusted in God, I trusted in my teammates, I just did you know, what I could to the best of my ability and I just tried to make you know, my nation proud, my family proud, my friends proud and I think you know, my teammates definitely stepped up to the plate a lot. Everybody performed their role. And I think, you know, this is the best, one of the best results we could have possibly achieved. I'm really just proud of everybody. The students hope that one day robotics will be recognized as a legitimate sport in Trinidad and Tobago, one which they believe will inspire youths to become athletes. This challenge was founded in 1989 by an MIT professor to capture the enthusiasm of students by combining the excitement of sport and the science behind what could potentially inspire students. Jason John, TTT News. And congratulations to them. The triumphant presentation college Shogunis Robotics team has garnered support from their member of parliament in their call to make robotics a sport in Trinidad and Tobago. He opened his contribution to the budget debate on Friday with this tribute to the team. These youths, um, these young gentlemen, they have shown that they are able to partner at an international level with alliance countries and they have placed third out of 193 in the international scale, um, stage. So I think, I think they are the next generation, they are leading the way in showing us what we need to do to be able to compete globally.